Welcome to STEM EVU Studios Live. This is STEM in Education, Sea, Air, and Space, Principles of Engineering. I'm Mr. Johnson. Today we're talking about one of our Sea Lab projects, Underwater Robotics. This is our underwater robot. It has a static structure, the materials being used, PVC, we have foam, we have three thrusters, an electrical unit, and we have a power supply, we have an integrated circuit. To operate this robot, we need to explore the technological system. The technological system involves the input, process, output, and feedback. The input part of the system involves this electrical box that controls the thruster. From the input device, we have electrical wires that's connected to our process unit, which has capacitor, diodes, and resistors that's controlling the energy that's flowing to the thruster system. And that takes us to the output. The thrusters are all part of our output. The thrusters allow the underwater robot to submerge, to travel forward, to reverse, and also to surface. Feedback system, we have a polarized switch. Let's test and evaluate the underwater robot technological system. The left thruster is turning in forward. That's in the off position. The left thruster is in reverse. Let's try the right thruster. The right thruster forward. Off. The right thruster is in reverse. So it is working correctly. We need to test one more thruster. That's the upper thruster that allows the underwater robot to submerge and surface. There it is. The upper thruster is working. It's in the surfacing position. And now let's check the submerging position. It is operating correctly. Thank you for joining us at STEM EDU Studios Live. STEM in Education, Sea, Air, and Space, Principles of Engineering. I'm Mr. Johnson. See you next time.